Uh, the welcome to Project Best Time TV or whatever you want to call that. Uh, today, since I figured out that a lot of you guys like to watch people unbox things, I thought today I'm gonna do the same with one of my newest purchase I did for my fishing trips. So let's see what we have right behind me here. Check that shit out.
As you could see, there's paddles on the side. They're like fixed here with a screw, so even even while fishing or whatever, they can't fall off. And as long as you don't need them or use them, you can fix them right here. But as with these parts too, it goes kind of hard, so you got to push like like an idiot i guess to really fix them that's not too practical i guess in the water okay on both sides you have like a bag for like tackle tackle pliers and whatever else you need there there's room for some boxes not a lot but it should be enough and if you need extra space there's a lot in the back too because it's all dry here because it's all closed so yeah here you can fix like i don't know a drink or something i guess the these bags are easily removable and I saw on their website you can like buy spare bags so you can exchange them depending on what you're fishing for I don't know the seat here is easy removable for I don't know what that's good for but for, for transportation I guess and you can put it in and like that and it's fixed again so that's easy well, as you could see, it's not that hard to put together. Um, my first impress impression is like, I know it's really well, it's really solid built all, all together. It's, it's PVC coated, so it should glide easily on the water. Um, and what I don't really approve of or what I'm a little bit uh, disappointed in is the fact that the overall idea is great of this thing I guess but then in the end in the the quality there are some issues I guess like like the holder for the paddles that need like really hard work to put in or other things like the filling for the air that doesn't really work with the part that it comes with I had to change it uh, myself to make it work because the the rubber thing that was on the pump that comes with there's a pump that's coming with this thing um, was too big so it, it wouldn't really connect with it and also yeah yeah overall it's a really nice boat but, but it looks like a really nice boat we're gonna find out on the water pretty soon but we will see
Um, uh, here's the details of the whole thing. If you're interested in that, I wrote this down. Its um, name is Tomahawk from the brand Seven Bass. Um, maximal load on this thing is like 150 kilos. So I still can eat some burgers un until it sinks. And the weight of the boat itself is uh, about 12 kilo, 13 kilos, without any tackle in it or or any addition put on. Uh, as it comes like that, so we're gonna we're gonna see how that's gonna work out if I if I have to to carry it longer distance distances to the water. And yeah, we're gonna see that, but yeah. It's it's built uh, solid, so so it comes with a little extra weight, I guess. Well, enough with the talking. We're gonna see how the thing works on the water pretty soon. Until then, thanks for watching. Peace. Well, good morning. So today I was just on the water right now to test the first uh, for the first time the new flow tube. And I gotta say, it's pretty awesome. It glides very well through the water. The paddles work well for longer distances, for short distances and maneuvering a little bit on the spot. There are still the fins that work pretty fine. And yeah, it's pretty awesome and I'm really looking forward to fish a lot with this thing here around in Switzerland uh, since I don't have a real boat so yeah it's definitely worth the money I guess as I said it's not perfect uh, like there are some smaller details that aren't like worked out the best they could be but all over it works pretty fine um yeah i didn't say uh, they haven't sunk in until now so that's a big plus i guess now let me demonstrate how the pal thing works just for a moment so So to me it glides kind of quickly I guess I would say that and yeah it's definitely also an option to fish like a bit bigger distances than I know that just like small ponds or whatever that we don't really have here to fish so yeah it works good it's, it's really still it feels really stable like with the the harder uh, material PVC material it's all pretty stable I came into a few waves uh, before but there wasn't any problem at all and also you sit kind of high if you can see that right here you sit not right uh, like with with the one I had before, I was sitting the whole time in the water, so now it's a, it's a little bit higher, I guess that's a plus point as well. The, the seat and everything is, is really stable, so you see, uh, but still really comfy, so yeah. Well, another plus for me is that there's a lot of accessory 
for these pods here. So there's like rod holders and several different uh, different mounts to like hold things, like even for the sonar and everything. There's a lot of accessories, so I definitely have to get me a rod holder for on the side because actually I just put them like here besides me the rods it it works but it's not like the best option I guess to I don't know in a in a hectic moment if there's a, f a fish I have to handle or whatever it's the it's definitely definitely more practical if you if if I have like the rods on the side all like organized instead of just like here besides me somehow and yeah so to wrap this all up would I would I recommend buy this bad boy right here definitely yes if you're looking for something serious in the floaty world it feels stable it feels comfortable it's easy to handle I would say I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have a lot of fun on it and yes I'm gonna I'm gonna fish this thing now from through all the fall and and uh, till winter until I freeze my legs off or whatever I guess I definitely would buy it if you're ready to spend invest some money for it I guess it's not the cheapest one but it's definitely you can see the difference and differences between this thing and like cheaper ones that that are made out of uh, different materials and so overall I would say it's worth the money we're gonna see what time brings thank you for watching and peace